Okay, so we're, we're just going to make some aesthetic changes with our content here. I'm going to make this a separate paragraph. Same by the return key. I'm going to make this a separate paragraph by hitting the return key. And this is a separate paragraph by hitting the return key. Therefore, I can make these different H tags. I'm going to command key 1 or control 1. It's now H1. This is going to be H2. This is going to be H2. Now, since I would have a rule for that, because I had rules over here for H1, H2, and H3, et cetera, et cetera. So this is my header div, and I did that by simply hitting Command 1 through Command 6. Control 1 could Control 6 on Windows. Now, div text are per paragraph, which means that if you double click this word and you hit Command 2, it's going to affect the whole entire paragraph because divs, I'm sorry, H tags are per paragraph, H1 through 6 per paragraph. Now, important step here. So I'm going to make branding this content here. I'm just going to copy some of this content and I'm going to put this up my branding tag and I'm going to make that command one. So this is all a header tag. So I'm just going to delete this, hit the return key, paste, and there's my content. Now this is my header tag H1 defined over here to the right. Now the H1 tag is the parent tag on the entire site. So in this particular case for main content, I like the font, I like the color, I like the size. I don't want it to be uppercase. So I can do this very simply by selecting the tag, selecting the H1 tag. Select the tag, make a rule. Select the tag, make a rule. So I just want to make a rule specifically for H1. H1 is inside of main content. We're just going to choose to do this h1 inside of main content so in this particular case the only thing i have to do now is transform the text to be capitalized therefore the parent tag is still going to stay intact the only thing i'm changing here is capitalization so i'm just making this capitalized make a change save a change okay now very important step here let's say as an example that i want to indent this first paragraph, I don't want to indent this paragraph or this paragraph. I just want to indent this first paragraph. So how can I do that? Well, I need to talk to the tag differently. So very important step here. This is a P tag. This is a P tag. This is a P tag. So how can I talk to this P tag separately from the rest of the P tags? Very simply, select the tag, select the tag, and give it an ID. We're going to call it exactly what it is. Now, you can't give it ID starting with a number. We're simply going to call it first, P-A-R-A, -A, first paragraph, inside my properties panel. Hit the return key. So, therefore, I can now make a rule, select the tag, select the tag, make a rule for a first paragraph, first paragraph specifically for main content. So, I hit OK. Okay. So, therefore, I could go to my category block, block category. I, indent this let's indent this three m spaces therefore the first paragraph is going to be indented three m spaces in addition to this let's also make the type for this first paragraph in just the first paragraph we're going to make this bold so now this first paragraph is bold and it's indented it's not affecting the second third and fourth paragraphs it's only affecting the first paragraph because just like the div tags have ids any tag can have ID. So that's a very, very important part of doing things correctly and working smart. So you can have a ID for whatever paragraph that you want. 